Hi, my name is Elaine Duff and I'm the mixologist for Pottery Barn. And today we're shooting at the beautiful poolside at the Modern Hotel in Honolulu. Nothing screams summer quite like tequila. And when I'm making summer cocktails, I love to work with 100% Blue Agave Ultra Premium Don Julio Tequila. It is perfect for your summer drink. So this cocktail that I'm gonna create is called the Herbs Watermelon. So the major ingredients are cilantro, fresh watermelon, fresh lime juice, and a little bit of simple syrup to just round it out. To create the herb watermelon, the first ingredient you wanna use is the cilantro. Now, like with all ingredients that you're using outside, anything that is herbs like mint or cilantro, I like to store it upside down in ice water. This keeps it from wilting. Now, cilantro is a quite a powerful flavor, so maybe four or five fresh pieces. You never wanna put the stems in there because that will add a bitter flavor. So to this, I'm gonna add my simple syrup, because you always want to muddle within your sweet. And when you're muddling, don't forget, you're just going to give it a gentle press and a twist. You don't want to smash it up, because then you'll be creating a salad. I just want to release the oils of the cilantro. So just a couple of quick, gentle presses. We're going to add our lime juice. Next, I'm going to add two ounces of fresh pressed watermelon. If we actually use whole watermelon. We cut off the rind and put it into a blender, and we juice it, and then we double strain it to get out any pulp. That way, you're really getting all the fresh flavors of the watermelon itself. And the last ingredient being the Don Julio. Now, for this drink, we're going to serve it in the rocks glass. I'm going to put ice in my shaker first, and we'll hold off on putting ice in my glass just for the fact that, well, I don't want it to melt at the poolside. So I'm going to fill it up to the top. Now, whenever you're shaking a cocktail that's being served over ice, you don't really need to shake it that long because, well, you're serving over ice, so the ice is going to keep it cold. So I'm just going to give it a gentle tap turn it over, give it a quick shake, just to mix the ingredients together. So a great tip for your summer cocktails is to freeze your fruit that you're gonna be using as a garnish. This way, it will help to keep the drink cold. It will also will look beautiful in your cocktail. So first, we're gonna add the watermelon slice, add my ice, and now I'm going to strain my cocktail into the serving glass. And look how beautiful that is. And voila, the herbed watermelon. 